Hey folks, Brian Blessing, glad to be with you, ATS.io in Las Vegas, and we're talking about a WGC golf event. This is going to be a good one. Always the WGC events. Big money, great field. It's the Workday Championship. It's at the Concession in Bradenton, Florida. It's named the Concession way back at the outset of the President's Cup. Jack Nicklaus conceded a two-foot putt to Tony Jacklin to make the President's Cup a draw. Hence, they call it the Concession. Uh, no one's conceding anything here. They're going for the big bucks. And the course, 72 is the par. 70, 474 yards is the distance. Patrick Reed is the defending champ. Now, this was an event that had been played in Mexico due to what we're dealing with. This has been moved to Bradenton, Florida. The projected winning score posted at the Superbook at the Westgate, 273.5, 14.5 under par is the projected winning score. It's hard to go against Dustin Johnson anytime he tees it up, especially in a smallish field, but at the smallest field has the top 15 players in the world in it. 7-1 to one for Dustin Johnson. John Rahm, a solid second choice here on the board at 9-1. to one. McElroy, 16-1. to one. He's trying to you know, get another WGC event and waiting for Rory's form to kick back in. Shoffley, steady as she goes. 16 to 1, 18 to 1 on just a group of Justin Thomas, DeChambeau, and Cantley. And DeChambeau won on this course, uh, you know, back when he was an amateur. Finau kicking the tires, just can't kick the door down, is on the board at 20 to 1. Looking for some price plays that can make some noise. Uh, in that 20 to 1 range, Ty Hatton is just on leaderboards all around the world now and still. 20 to 1 is a juicy price. It's 20 to 1 because you know, who's in the field along with him. But he has every opportunity to be right there. A couple of guys that are knocking on the door. Don't forget Cam Smith. He was in contention last week at Riviera. He was second at the Masters last year. He sneaks up on people. 50 to 1 is a real nice price on a guy like Cam Smith who's in good form and can roll the rock uh, with the best of them. And Louis Oosthuizen is a sneaky guy uh, at 60 to 1. You know, Louis, I think, has had a little bit of a resurgence. He's on the first page of the leaderboard a lot more often. It used to kind of be an occasional thing, and you think about Louis at the Masters and at British Opens. But he's kind of always knocking on the door, and a guy you can always consider. This is a great event. Of course, DJ's the guy to beat. It's a WGC event, the concession. I'll be talking about that with Adam Burke on his podcast on Tuesday. Adam does a great job for you every weekday right here at ATS.io.